Hey, what's up you guys? It's Jessica, and welcome back to Pokemon Red! Okay, so... Um... Last time... We went through the Seafoam Islands, and we met Articuno, and did not catch it, unfortunately. And then we came here to Cinnabar Island. But okay, so there was a little issue that I need to talk about. When I went to come back on here for this episode, for some reason, it didn't save properly. So, it ended up saving. Like, I had to start at the point when I was at Articuno. So, I know I did not go and catch Articuno then, but that is where I ended up, and I just had to finish going through the cave to get here. Um, I'm actually gonna look and see if there's anything I need. I think I'm definitely gonna get some more repels. Probably should get more potions, and I should probably do something about all those ultra balls, because I don't think I need any. Because I don't think there's anything really of importance in the mansion that I need to actually get. Or capture, I guess. I don't know if I actually have any other... I don't think I have any, uh... Um... More potions in the PC. I can check real quick. Oh, I do have the fossil, so I could re... re Revive that, but I have no reason to. I got my Master Ball. Obviously, I don't need that. I'm just gonna take out these potions, so that way... You know, healing items, in case I do need them. Hopefully I won't. Nah, I'm gonna buy some more potions, probably, and some more, um... Uh... Repels... For... In the Mansion, because that place is full of Pokémon. And I really don't feel like running into Pokemon every five steps. I honestly could have sold all those Ultra Balls because I don't... I really doubt I would need them for anything. Okay, so we're just gonna get ten Hyper Potions. Because we already got some potions, so we probably don't need a whole lot. Um... I'll buy like 10 more of these. Okay, so I know I haven't uploaded a video. Oh, crap. I know I did not upload a video in a while. And I know literally at this point, I don't think anyone actually cares because I don't think anyone actually watches my channel. But, um, yeah, so I haven't uploaded since, like, July. I know me and my brother were supposed to be doing that, um, that series, the Minecraft series. But, unfortunately, I didn't even know I had a repel on. Unfortunately, we ended up getting too busy, and, um, we were not able to continue that series. So, yes, there is Pokeballs in here, but no, I don't think any of these are electrodes or is it electrodes or is it the other thing? I can't even remember right now which is which. You know, the one that looks like a Pokeball. I think that's only in the um, power plant where that happens, where you go up to an item or go up to a Pokeball that you think is a Pokeball, but it's actually a Pokemon. Okay, so yeah, me and Jason were supposed to be doing that series this summer, the Minecraft survival series, but we got way too busy with fair, like especially once once we got into July, because unless you do fair, um, you like you don't understand just how much work it actually does take because they're they're animals, so you have to take care of them every day whether you want to or not. And since a lot of times you want to do 
try and do good at the fair when it comes to showing your animals, you'll have, you have to work with them like every day. Can I rest in these or are they just... Okay, there's nothing there. I don't know if that was actually open before. But I do know there was a... Okay, now that's closed. I have no idea how to get through this mansion. But, yeah, so, unfortunately that series did not continue as planned, um, as of right now. Is this... I can't get out this old place is one big puzzle, of course. I mean, I guess I'm gonna try and not talk to anybody, because I don't think anyone actually... I don't know if anyone actually gives me what I need, or if I just if I have to find it myself. Um. Oh yeah, I forgot. I still don't have my last move. Um. Anyways. Yeah, so we got too busy. We didn't have time to work on the series anymore because we got way too busy trying to get stuff ready for fair. And by the time fair was over, we were so far behind. It's like, there's no point. We're barely going to get anything done with the series before the summer's over. So, as of right now, there are no plans to continue that series because it, it would just be really hard to record with me being at college and him being at home and it just kind of seemed like, eh, just kind of gave up on it. <laughs> kind of like with the Roblox parkour series. It seems like me and Jason can't keep a series going together, but it's whatever, I guess. Maybe sometime in the future if I actually become more popular as a YouTuber, I can, will actually be able to do a series, you know, have, like, actually have a series. I don't know if I should even read these. We I have no idea what that word is. The newly discovered Pokemon Mew. Yeah, so this is, this is just like, this is the mansion where Mewtwo was created. So basically all these like diaries that you find around here are all just like, um, like all the books are just like little diary entries about how Mewtwo was created, how they like found Mew, and did the experiments on it to, um, get Mewtwo. But I'm not going to even bother reading all those. Um, I should probably look up if you actually have to like talk to someone to get the... Because the reason why we're here is because we got to get the key to go into the gym because the gym is locked for some reason. So once you get that key, then you can like you know, get into the gym to fight the gym leader. Um, but, I don't know if you have to actually talk to somebody to do that, or if it's like an item on the ground. I'm actually going to go up this set of stairs first, even though I know there is a second set. Um, I'm going to try and not have to talk to anyone, because I do not wish to talk to anyone. There's got to be something back here. Max revive. Okay, that's pretty useless to me. Okay. Ah, crap. I forgot. I need to put a repel on. Okay, so there is Growlithe in here. I already knew that. There's no point in me even fighting him, because I'm not going to get any more experience. Alright. Repel. I need you. Where is it? Okay. I'm going to get rid of these, like, the super repels before I use the, I believe they're max repels. You just need to either... Okay, I can run past. I'm pretty sure I probably have to fight that guy. 
And I do not want to fight anyone. As everyone already knows. Okay, I believe I'm on the roof now. Let's see what we can find. If we can find anything. Okay, there's a ball. Iron. Okay, so I need to hit that other switch. I'm not sure if there's like a certain combination of switches where I'd have to like go down to the bottom floor and actually press the switch there if that would do anything for me up here. Oh crap, I'm gonna have to fight him. Maybe he gives me the key. I hope so. If he does, I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> like, I don't care what else is in here, I don't need any of it. It's a scientist. And he's got a magmite, which is a pure electric type in this, um, game, I'm pretty sure. And, but since I do not have anything in particular to take that down, good ol' uh, pound will just do the trick for now. Not magneton. Oops, I didn't mean to hit yes. I believe this is also just a pure electric type. These should go down with no issue. I don't even think I have a fire type be or fight. Yeah, I don't even have a fire type move, even if it was part steel. But steel type was not around in this game, so Voltorb. That's yeah, that's the one that it is that you hit them in the poke or in the um, power plant. Because you think it's a Pokeball, but it's actually a Voltorb. I'm going to try and get defeat this gym today. If I can do that, then all i got to do is... Um... And, well, that'll be good enough for today, I guess. Did you did you not actually have any... So you're stuck trying jumping off or... Of, no. I'm not gonna do that because then I know I'm gonna like just fall down to like the bottom floor or something. Okay, there's nothing even in here. I'm actually pretty sure this just goes right, right into that same room I was... No? Where am I? Oh, great. Yeah, there must be some combination of switches between the upstairs and the downstairs that I have to push, which... Great. Just... Amazing. So I need to go back up to this top floor and put another repel on because I'm not dealing with wild Pokemon. I should just put these like at the top of my list. There's all these beds, but I don't think I can actually sleep in any of them, which is really frustrating. And I gotta hit this. I'm actually not sure how to get into that room right over there. I'm gonna try jumping down over here, see where this takes us. Okay, so there's a scientist there that I might... Is this the key? Please tell me this is the key. No, it's a Carbos. But I can't leave any area unsearched because if I do, more than likely that'll be where the key was. This hole looks interesting. Does this lead somewhere? Ah, oh, crap! <laughs> Are you kidding me? I should have known. Okay, was there... S I believe there was only one switch down here. But I'm gonna just double check. Because I don't want to miss anything. Wait, this is where I just was. I am very confused right now. That's what I hate about this. This game. Actually, maybe I don't need to hit the switch that's in here. Or down here. So I'm gonna leave it alone. 
And then I gotta go back up here. No, I don't. That dude almost saw me. I don't know if he was... Or if he could or not. Or if he fights me. That's what I'm trying to say. I can't speak today. I don't know if this does anything else for me or if it just opens this up. I'm gonna try jumping down. Okay, so it's just the same spot. That scientist there, he actually might ha be the one I gotta talk to. We'll see if he's the one that I have to talk to to get the key. If not, well, then I'm just going to have to Google it because I have no idea. But I'm guessing he's probably the one because I haven't seen any other items or really any other places to go. And I fought everyone else except for that one dude, but there's no way it would be there. That'd be way too easy. I accidentally just licked my microphone. So if you heard that, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I have it really close to my face because otherwise um, you might not be able to hear me. It tasted really bad. <laughs> I just wiped it off because I'm like, I'm afraid it has spit on it now. Um. He said, ouch. A key? I don't know what you're talking about. Are you kidding me? Okay, so no, he does not have it either. Oh wait, wasn't this where I... Yeah, and then this goes outside, so I, got, I gotta go down, down these stairs. Okay, there's a ball over there, so I probably have to go over there to that ball. Okay, there's another guy in there, but I'm not sure how I get to him. I completely forgot this place had a basement. Like, that's how long it's been since I've played any of the first gen games. Um. Turn around, please. Oh, thank you. Really? Okay. So I hit this. That's definitely what I have to do. I don't want that guy to see me because I don't want to have to fight him. Oh, what's this? Full restore. Yeah, so the key is definitely up with that other scientist who is up over this way. This is a really big basement for like the size of this building. I'm gonna see... Okay, that's another switch. I'm gonna see if I can actually... A rare candy. Okay, so obviously that's gotta open up. I don't believe that scientist guy has the switch. I hope he doesn't. Or the key. Otherwise, I'm just wasting my time majorly. Alright, please tell me this is the key. Why? What do I have to do to get the stupid key? Like, come on, people. I probably have to talk to that scientist guy. You do that, or this is it. Okay. And I am not wasting any time. We're just escape roping out of here. Good thing I went to this Pokemon Center and healed, otherwise I would be very angry right now. Because I would be... Well, I guess I have fly. And I think I can fly here as long as I've been here. Well, I'm actually not sure. Not sure how the whole flying and whatever thing are. Alright, I believe I got enough healing items. Let's go to the gym. So as long as I answer all these right, I won't have to fight any trainers. Get it wrong and face a trainer. OK, 
Caterpie evolves into Butterfree. Okay, so technically, this would be no. It evolves into Metapod and then Butterfree. But it, the answer is yes, because eventually it does evolve into Butterfree. I don't remember if I ever made that mistake myself. Or if it was just because I saw it. Um. Because someone else made the mistake and I watched it in their video and they, uh. They said no and had to fight the trainer. There are nine certified Pokemon League badges. No, there's only eight. I should know because I actually own the Kanto. Or own. Like. A replica set of the Kanto gym badges. And they're, they're pins. And I know the Pokemon Center did come out with some. Poliwag evolves three times. No, nothing evolves three times. I mean, yeah, you got Eevee that can evolve three different ways, but doesn't evolve three times. Okay. I know Pokemon, the Pokemon Center did come out with a um, set of the Kanto um, gym badges, but they, they were super expensive, first of all. They were like over a hundred dollars, whereas I got this other set, it was like Um, I didn't actually, I have no idea what it actually said because I was just clicking through. Yeah, they were like over $100, but I got this like set made by, I don't even know what company it was, or is, and it was nowhere near that much money. So... Pokemon of the same kind and level are not identical. Yes. Some of these are actually kind of hard. Like, if you were like a little kid doing this, I don't know how you would even know some of this stuff. Like that one. It's like, Pokemon of the same kind and level are not identical. And it's like, well, if you're a little kid, you don't realize about stats and whatnot. You might think, oh yeah, they are the same. I have no idea, but I don't think Tombstoner is a move, so I'm going to say no. <laughs> Alright. Ha! I am Blaine. I am the gym leader of... C or I am the leader of Cinnabar Gym. My fiery Pokemon will incinerate all challengers. You better have burn heal. Classic line. So yes, we are facing off against Blaine, our second to last gym leader before the Elite Four. So we just gotta fight him, the one more gym leader, and then finally we'll be able to make our way to the Elite Four and finally finish off this series that has been going on for way too long. I know I don't have any like regular watchers. I have like 12 subscribers and I don't even I'm pretty sure like two or three of those accounts are mine. And then I know like one or two is Jason's and then some of my friends. <laughs> so none of them are regular watchers. I know Jason used to watch my Pokemon Red series, but he got bored of it. I don't blame him. Blaine is about to use the Rapidash. I haven't even been paying attention. I've just been pounding everything to death. <laughs> yeah, it's like I'm not even worried about it. If I can go, because I can go faster, and I can knock them out in one hit. So it's like they can't even hit me. So there's really no point in me being worried or anything. And Arcanine. Didn't mean to do that. Now, if you were doing this, just a regular run-through of Pokemon Red... Oh, dang! 
they didn't kill him. <laughs> but don't worry, it'll kill him this next turn. It should. Yeah, if you were just playing this as like a regular run through of Pokemon Red, I could see how Blaine's gym could be pretty hard. I mean, if you got a good water type like Gyarados or yeah, you can yeah you would have Lapras at this point if you have some of the good water types with like Surf or Hydro Pump. Then is Hydro Pump even in this game? I don't know, but with some good water type moves, and you shouldn't even have a problem. The Volcano Badge heightens the special abilities of your Pokemon. Here, you can have this too. I don't know what it is. Uh, what can I throw out? And we'll throw out the Max Revive because... It's like I can't use it. Yeah, we gotta scroll through all this text again. We received TM38 Fire Blast. Yeah, but not even going to bother with that because I did not want to teach Mew a fire type move. Yeah, I don't need that anymore. Okay, so we're gonna get out of here. And I think we are going to fly to the next town that we need to go to because I don't believe there's anything more that we need to do here. So we're going to get on Mew, fly to Viridian City, and I, and I think that's probably about all we're going to do today because I really I have a headache for some reason. I don't feel like doing anything more right now. Alright, so, yep, here we are in Viridian City, and the series should be almost done, only going to be a few more episodes, but if you guys are, are liking the series and have liked the series, please leave a like and subscribe, because it would help me out a whole lot, especially because I'm just a very small startup channel at the current moment. I guess you could say a startup channel, but I've had it for almost two years now already. <laughs> But, yes, so if you guys enjoyed it, please like and subscribe. Comment down below any comments, questions, or suggestions you have for me. You can also comment ideas for new series, like my whatever next series that for me to do, even though I do have some more ideas. Hopefully some more ideas that people will find interesting and actually want to watch my videos. But, yeah, that'll be all for today, and I will see you guys next time.